Hello, welcome to the video. This is going to be a short and sweet point on a few useful plugins to make your Steam Deck look more vibrant and ease of use, and of course, a few custom boot animations along the way. And this is going to be very short and sweet and fast, so I hope we can keep up. Let's get to Start menu on the Steam Deck. We go to Systems, Enable Developer Mode. Once we get that enabled, we are going to scroll down to the very bottom until we see the new tab developer and make sure CEF remote debugging is active. And if you have a Bluetooth device or USB, just make sure it's enabled or plugged in. Reset your Steam Deck. Once we get reset, we are then going to go to your Steam menu again, go to power, and we're going to go to desktop mode. Once we get to desktop mode, we're going to open up a browser of choice. Mine will be Firefox, use whatever you want, type in Decky Loader. It will be link one in the description and a top page on top link on the page, the GitHub. So we're going to scroll down until we see latest release. Copy that. Now we're going to go to your Steam applications. We're going to then go to systems, go to consoles. And if we don't have a password set up, we're going to set up our password for a console by typing in passwd. And of course, I'm just going to use either use, I'm just going to put wd as my password. Confirm your password, and now we are going to copy in link one in the description or paste in. Once we get that done, here's a brief little preview of what it looks like once it's installed. Once it won't take too long, believe me. And once it's installed, we're going to reset our Steam Deck. And once our Steam Deck is rebooted, we're going to hit the three little dots on the Steam Deck located on the right side. We are going to go to the power outlet we just installed. You'll see a prompt that says Decky Loader Update. So we're going to hit the little gear icon and we're going to go to General and then we're going to see Updates and then we're going to Install Updates. Once we get uh, Updates installed, your Steam Deck will of course reset. And upon reset, we are going to get ready for the next step. Of course, that next step is going to be hitting your three little Steam Dots located on your Steam Deck on the right side, and we're going to go to the Power Outlet again. And now we are going to hit the little store looking icon, and we're going to type, in, or look for, I should say, Anime Changer, which is optional. It just allows for custom animation of boots, and install it if you want to use it. And the next one we're going to use is Proton, Proton DB Badges which I will show you in a later on video. And then Vibrant Deck is also something we want to do. Vibrant Deck, of course, is your saturation, Gamma Red, Gamma Blue, Gamma Green. Just mess with it until you get to the settings you like. It will make your Steam Deck way more vibrant and just overall better looking in general. And it's especially useful if you have a 512 gig, the 64 and 256 gig, you will not see as much of a change, of course. So here's a few little brief, inf a brief preview of Anime Changer. Just browse through it if you like what you like. DB badge. This is, of course, as you can see on the left of the screen, it says broken. It's unplayable. Silver means it's playable, but it will need a few changes. Gold means everything's good out of the box. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you.